Hi there. We're going to talk about display advertising. You know those adverts you see all over the internet? Some are banners, whilst others are text-based or use videos. This is called display advertising. And we're going to explore what it is, how it works, and how it can help you attract more customers. Think of display advertising as the digital version of a billboard, print ad or TV advert you see offline. Businesses pay whoever owns the ad space, hoping to get their ad seen by the right kinds of people and then turn those people into customers. In the online world of display advertising, ad space isn't on billboards or TV channels, but on the websites we visit. Display advertising gives businesses the chance to pay for their ads to appear when the right kind of person is on the right kind of page. And there are lots of ways to do this. You can make deals directly with the owners of a website, or you can use networks to match businesses with lots of different websites that have ad space to sell. You can decide to show your ads on specific web pages or to specific groups of people, or even both. Let's imagine you're passionate about films. So you've created a podcast where you do film reviews. Now you want to market it. Think about the people who might be interested in a film review podcast and what else they might be looking at online, like cinema websites, official movie sites or film forums. The pages where your customers are are also where you should be. Of course, your customers won't always be looking at websites about film. With display advertising, you can get your ads in front of them when they're browsing other things. So you can target people with specific interests like film while they're checking the weather or reading the news. Perhaps they're you know, visiting blogs and browsing around all other sorts of websites they might want to visit, even if those websites have nothing to do with film. So display advertising offers businesses the ability to reach relevant audiences all across the internet. It's actually quite amazing. And it's one reason why display advertising is a great way to build awareness of you and your business. For example, if you've just created your film review podcast, you'll need to make people aware that your new product exists. With display adverts, you can get noticed by just the people you want to reach. But display advertising isn't only about getting your name out there. Display is also a great way to drive traffic to your website, build engagement with your visitors and win new customers. How? Well, you might choose to show adverts to people who have visited your website, but who haven't yet subscribed to the podcast. So as they browse the news, check the weather or watch videos, your display advertising can remind them to subscribe with a special incentive or promotion customized for them. This is called retargeting, and we'll cover this in more detail later. Let's recap. We now know that display advertising lets you be right where your customers are and supports many different marketing goals. Next, we'll explore how display differs from search advertising and how the different elements of a display campaign work. Then we'll move on to talk about ways to find your ideal audience using different targeting options. Finally, we'll learn a bit about how to use retargeting to reach people after they've already interacted with you. So I hope you're ready. It's time to explore the exciting world of display advertising.